Malaysia has not yet detected the new Omicron variant XE. However, it's important for us to stay ahead of the new variant in case it makes its way to Malaysia. To educate us more about the Omicron XE variant is virologist Dr. Kumita Tivadas. Previously, when we talked about which is the most dominant strain, um, we actually referred to BA2, the Omicron BA2 variant, and that's because it had a really, really high transmissibility rate, um, and it accounted for about 90% of the cases that we saw in the past couple of months. But what we know about XE so far is that it has a slightly higher transmissibility rate compared to Omicron BA2, so it's about 10% higher, so it means it's easier easier to spread. So far, we've only seen about less than 1% of XE globally, and they're mostly localized in European countries. Um, but despite us knowing that it has a higher transmissibility rate, we still don't quite know much about a few other important questions. So how severe is it? Um, is it capable of causing reinfection? Do our vaccines work against it? Dr. Kumita stressed how important testing and genomic surveillance are in order to best prepare for new emerging variants. How Malaysia can best prepare is, of course, we can still continue with testing, we can still continue with genomic surveillance. Um, the UK, for example, they were actually able to detect XE because they had actually submitted more than 1 million Omicron samples to be sequenced. So that's a lot. And that's why they were able to detect XE, um, even though there was just a really, really tiny amount of cases at that point. So I do have to point out that, you know, if we look at our surrounding neighboring countries, uh, Thailand actually just detected their first XE case over the weekend. Um, so, and I think the other nearby countries, India also had one case recently. And with borders opening, that means that, you know, we may be at risk. So we do have to be extra vigilant. We still have to keep up our mitigation measures, um, all the necessary control measures, um, so that we are able to control and detect XE or any other new variants when it does crop up.